What is up, everybody? Welcome back to Double F Outdoors, guys. We are back again. Guys, this is the day. Today is day of blue line fishing. This is day one of blue line fishing. Hopefully, you can get a couple videos out of this. Guys, I'm super pumped, super excited. It's really early in the morning. About 5.50, I'm on my way over to meet him right now. Guys, this is gonna be an awesome, epic series. Thanks for tuning in. Thanks for coming along. Follow us, subscribe, like this video. Let's get this party started. Let's go. I was reeling that in. That was insane. Seven plus? It looks it. Yes. There we go. Boom. Look at that. We've been red fishing. I, I fished in Florida since I was eight years old and on the coast. Yeah. And it, you know, I've, I've had days where we've caught 12, 15 redfish, which oh, is phenomenal. Wow. Our first day down to Venice, uh, we stopped at a little over 90. Oh, wow. It was a, just unbelievable. And I'd all heard, always heard these stories about it. And it was just literally to a, your sight, your ribs hurt. You had to rip your rod up. That's insane. Uh, and then we did an offshore trip the next day to yellow fin tuna, black fin tuna, we about 55 miles offshore. And it was unreal. I mean, that's awesome. Uh, that was my, I caught one of my, I thought the biggest tuna I've ever caught. 64 fan yellow fin. Oh, wow. Uh, if they catch them out there this year, they've been catching them uh, right at just under 200 pounds. Oh, wow. There you go. It's a start. Got to start somewhere. We'll come back. We will come back. We'll find them. It'll just take a little bit Oh, wait a minute. Got him. I couldn't tell if it was the boat there for a second or not. That's a decent one. It's a good start for me. I'll take it. There we go. I didn't get skunked. Let's get started. This stuff for last year just hasn't been as much. It's good fish. Yeah, it is. It's a nice sized fish. There we go. That's a little better. Ooh, that's a real good one. Oh. That was a good one. That was a good fish, wasn't it? It's a couple pounder. Yeah, I think I might have had the best uh, angle right there for a yeah, second. Be, even though it didn't get boated. See, Woo. what we like to call that is, that's an LDR. That's a long distance release. <laughs> <laughs> I like that. I'm going to have to use that. That is an LDR. Right an LDR, a long distance <laughs> release. Yes. Yeah. That is fantastic. Just like uh, when I was fishing tournaments, some of the semi-pro guys I fished with, and they get a backlash. They didn't call it a backlash. They called it a professional overrun. <laughs> So, professional overrun. <laughs> you know, and they would call those LDRs, so that was just a long distance. Oh, that was I a... I didn't want to get that fish in the boat. I didn't want to get my hands wet. <laughs> you didn't want to get your hands wet? No, no, no. No? Of course yeah. not. So, that that's, was just, you know, that's good. Just trying to take care of everybody's boat. <laughs> just trying to take care of everybody. <laughs> and there's what it is. Well, you know, we just got to go find another one. That's all we got to do here. We will find some more. 
So, um, and then for we were talking yesterday, she's like, because you know I was asking Jim and Pam, I was like, oh, was like Pizza Chef still open? Ooh, I was reeling that in. That was insane. There you go. That was crazy. Good stuff. That shocked me a little bit actually. But uh, ooh, that's a really thick one. It's got a little, a little thicker roundness. Question for you then. So like, I throw a spinner bait or a chatter bait a lot in the spring. Mm -hmm. You know, and you kind of, you can do varying speeds, but normally, especially early when it's kind of cold, the slower the better. So you talked about kind of varying techniques. So like, what do you do in the summer different with your spinner bait than like, say the spring? Right, in the springtime, you know, I'm gonna move that bait slow. Like, yeah. just barely turning those blades mm -hmm. over. And there are times they're gonna want it faster, but in the summertime, what I usually do is start at the top of the water column. So I'm starting out shallow, mm -hmm. I'm reeling it fast, almost burning that bait underneath it. Mm -hmm. And then I'll work the water column down on a straight retreat. Okay. And then, if that doesn't start producing fish, then I'll start, a Basically, like with a crankbait, a start stop retrieve. Okay. Where I'm start stop and start stop. Yeah. If that doesn't work. Then a lot of times I'll go to what's called a yo yo retrieve. So I'm, you know, I'm picking space. And even if I'm throwing up against timber, I'm going to let it sink all the way down, just like you are that creature bait. Yeah. Now I'm going to work it off the bottom. Okay. Just like that, just like a creature bait. Okay. So that's what I'm doing. I'm, I'm varying my, I start out varying speed and depth, work the water column down. Okay. And then when that doesn't work, then I go to a totally different type of, or if it doesn't work, you know, then I go to a totally different type of. Uh, that being a yo-yo or stop and go. But what I'm trying to always do is fish just like a um, crankbait or like that bait. It's yeah. a contact bait. Mm -hmm. It's meant to run into stuff. Bang yeah. To mm -hmm. And a lot of folks, when they fish a spinner bait, they think it's an open water bait. Yeah. It can be. But if you watch the guys who really made their name fishing spinner bait, I used to use the Roll Martin. Yeah. Van Dam, they just fish complete contact bait. So that's what I do differently. There we go. Makes it productive for me. Be fine. And he just went downhill from there really fast. And it was, uh, like I said, it was pretty tough, but I think we're all going to, oh, there's one. I think, or I'm on a log. I think I'm on a log. Oh, no, there's a fish. He might have been stuck on a log, but there he goes. He fooled me. I was like, there's something on the end of this. A log doesn't shake. A oh. <laughs> I was really confused there for a second, actually. I was like, either I've got a 20 pounder and it's not gonna move, or there we go. And like I said, he, he felt a lot better when he was wrapped around the tree, but. He would have just been the size of he would have just been the size of the tree limb. Oh, man. Ooh. Here we go. That's a good one. That's probably the one that was rolling, too. I guarantee it. Maybe. That was on the floating rattle trap. There you go. I felt him come up behind it after I'd stopped it off that weed bed, kind of did a stop start there. Pop it. He, it's, there we go. You may be on something. Is that that rattle trap? Yeah. That's a good fish. Ooh. 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 That's a pretty fish. You got it? There we go. Woo! There we go. Dude, that's seven plus. That's seven plus? It looks it. Look at that. On the rattle trap. That's pretty Double fish. F outdoors. And yes. Fishing are getting it done. There we go. Boom. Oh, look at this. Look at that. Look at that big old chomper. I'm telling you right now. Oh, man. That's pretty fish. That's gorgeous. Were you just straight retrieving that? Started to, I brought it right off that drop. Yeah. And uh, when I did, we're gonna weigh him too. When I brought it off that drop uh, and started to retrieve it again, he picked it up. Ooh. I'm telling you right now, boys and girls, I'm a big, pretty big guy. Like, oh yeah. Deal here. That's a big. Oh yeah. 
That's a big fish. I would not surprise me if that thing's seven plus. Look at that. That is 21, 21 and inches. 21 and a half. Alright, you wanna hold on to him and I'll get a weight on Yeah. Yeah. Oh, I won't drop him. I am honored that you trust me with this as well. <laughs> I am very honored. How much? Let's see, try to get it. it. Looks like it's gonna be about a little over six. A little over six? Uh, yeah. It's okay. That's still a big fish. It's still big That's fish. a still big fish. I told everybody that blue line fishing catches big fish. Six eight. Six eight. Six and a half. We'll take it. We will take it. That is pretty. That's a stud, man. That is a stud. I mean, what a stud. Man, you talk about a. We're I mean, still kind of in the start of the day, too. Yeah, that's. Tap on the head. Ooh, there she goes. There, she goes. That was good there we stuff, go. Man, that's all right. There we go. I am all for that. And I don't fish with a power worm very much. So my dad's also been talking smacks. He's like, oh, see, I told you that power worms were tight. I'm like, who won though? Yep. That doesn't matter. Ooh, I think something just thumped mine. Yeah. Oh, I think I have like a real, uh, real little one. That I couldn't even tell there was something on there. Uh, oh, Ooh. that's a that's a decent little bass. I had no idea. Oh, no LDR there. Well, there he goes. Self release though. Well, self. Yeah, that's actually bigger than I thought. He must have been swimming towards me because I felt the thump and I caught up and I was like. I must have something, and then I got up here. Well, you saw it took oh, yeah. off on me. It's a nice yeah. little, little, little guy. Double left after we're Yes. Yes. So the challenge is most fish, right? I'm just kidding. You can. <laughs> most and weight. I'd about to say, because if the challenge is in weight, I'm in trouble. Is that another one? I got another one. Oh, I'm on fire. Two in a row. I'm not going to have to edit that film. Yeah, throw back up in there. Oh. It's a little bigger, too. Here we go. Oh, one hook again. Oh, don't do that. 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 Oh, do that. Oh, do that. Oh, do that. There we go. Woo. I'll take it. That's place, mine are getting bigger. <laughs> Watch, I'm just kidding. Watch out. Oh, uh, Ooh. <laughs> there they We may have found them. In years, you may be seeing a lot more rattle trap videos on Double right. F Outdoors. Tis the season. Tis the season. Not a springtime fall. Yep. Yeah. That is my biggest of the day by far. That is. You measure him out if you want, or I got the scales. Uh, here, we'll just. You want to measure him for me? It'd be easier for you to do it. We don't need to weigh him, but. He's going to be. He's going to be pretty close. 15 and, 15 and a half. There we go. Another nice size keeper. Here's my phone. I'll take a picture of that one. I got it. I'll just do a. My dad says show off. Is that, what he said? that is exactly what that's what he said back. <laughs> Fish has no idea. It just thinks it's getting a meal, and then. And the neat thing is, you don't know what you're setting hook on either. No. Mm-hmm. You know, full bank run, and then again, it could be that eight pounder. Oh yeah. Know. Well, then some of them can be deceiving too, like that one that I didn't even know I had one. Yeah, that's exactly what that fish did. Was going straight to the boat. Well, I've had a couple do that to me. Oh, there's one. Oh, I missed. I didn't get a good hook set. He took off. Shoot. No, it's fine. Well, that was more of my bad. I 
I should have reeled down more. I'm smarter than that. Gosh darn it, Neil. Oh my gosh, I had a fish on there the whole time. Good fish? I don't know. Exactly. Oh my. Oh, that's a good fish. How did in the heck did I not know that I had that on there? Uh, let's see this. I might be able to get him. Stop jumping. Uh, he's stuck in her head. Woo, there we go. Man, I feel like an idiot now. <laughs> Man, I missed him, and he's just. Hey, I missed him. hey, that's a log. No, hey, that's a fish. Oh my gosh. That's all right. We'll go back to. Uh... Eric, I promised my dad taught me how to we'll fish. To, you know, hook sets and fish bites one on one. <laughs> Man, I'm sitting here like, oh, I get to fish with Mr. Krogman today, and here twice I've been like, oh, I missed him. Wait, there's a fish on there. Yeah, that was, that's a good fish. That's a nice decent fish. Him out? Yeah, I'll smash him out. He's probably one that's or two. Right. Uh, I bet he's going to be close to 15, 16, somewhere there. 16, and he is. 16, the there 16 we go. Inches. There we go. Good fish. That was a good fish. I knew. Gosh darn it. You guys got to stop swimming towards the boat. You're making me look stupid. All right. Log. It would be, I might just sit around and make baits all day. There you go. We'll have a, we'll have to put rip jaw on the map. That's what we'll have to do. And That's what I'd like to do. We'll, uh, you know, I've maybe I'll go pro and we'll just... Be my head sponsor, sponsor. Rip Jaw, just on the middle of my jersey. That's also a great name, by the way. Yeah, I'm uh, having a buddy of mine. Trying to oh, do there's one. That was a good thump, too. Good fish? Well, he felt like it. Got him. That's not a log. Uh, I'm sure this time. Oh, boy. Woo! Stay down. Stay down. Stay down. Stay down. Stay nope. Down. Stop jumping. Stop jumping. Oh, you better keep that rod tipped in. I would go all the way down. There. Man, it's a good one. Stay down. It's a good fish. He's going he's gonna to jump again. I know he is. Oh, come on. Yeah, I'm if I can. Come on, 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 come on. Let's go. That's a bigger fish. That's a good fish. I've caught two in a row. Look at that. He was not going nowhere. Not going anywhere. Look at him outside. Oh, yeah. He was on it. I have no idea what happened. Come around and got him. Let's go. That's a good fish. That's a decent fish. Let's go. <laughs> Double F and Blue Line are tearing up these Indiana bass. Not doing too bad this morning. Let's Not go. Too bad at all. We're gonna That's have some. Fatty. That is a fatty. That is a fatty. He wasn't gonna go nowhere either. That was a good hook set. That was. I bet he's a what two to three maybe. Uh, yeah. Yeah. It's easy two to three. That's easy. Pretty fish. He took off jumping too. Oh well, well, we can we can measure. Him. My dad just asked me if I caught any. <laughs> Send that picture. <laughs> 30, seconds ago. 30 seconds ago. I bet he's probably easy 16 again. Oh, yeah. 17 and a quarter. 17 and a quarter? Yes. Here we go. Boom. That's a nice fish. Guys, we are. We moved this little pocket. What is that? You've caught, I've caught, that's two for me. That's at least, and I've, I've caught the one, so it's at least three out of this. Three pocket. out of this little pocket in probably 20, 30 minutes? Yeah, yeah, and we've got a nice, nice little. Bleh. That was fun. That was fun. What was fun on that? All right, double up. We're going to sign off here and then pick it up in tomorrow's video because we're going to make this out several days. So we'll see you guys tomorrow. And hopefully, if I have a feeling that even though it'll be today, yeah. The next video is going to be just as good as this one. So we'll, we'll see you guys on the other side, everybody.